Critical meaning, I'll drown. Okay. Or Jack Kelso will drown. Character. Hello, randomly appearing anonymous uh, assholes. Mixed with guns. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 I don't like people shooting at me. I got some lead in the face. There you go. Man, those poor janitors. They have a lot to do. Whoa! The music can't go this way. Okay, we're getting a little sick of the music here. Just a little bit. Ha! <laughs> He's hanging. <laughs> He's half hanging across the across the railing. Running low on ammunition? Is that what you mean? Can I pick up a new one then? Almost out, need a new weapon. This is a pump action, this is a bar. I think it's a Garen or something like that. Okay, what the, what the hell is this? Okay, I came from here. I'm going this way. I can't open that. That way is a dead end. Like, I, did I come from that way and does it mean I have to go this way? Oh yeah, okay. Are you okay, Princess? I felt better. He saved me from the doctor. Hi, Tex. Do you remember me? I'm not sure that I do. If you come here to kill her. Why would I do that, soldier? Isn't that why you're all here? No. I'm here to get her out. Dumbass. I'm out. Would not be. You haven't come for me. No shit. No, not you. It ends here. You were with the sixth on Sugarloaf, weren't you? I was. And the ha. Yes, I was. You're Sergeant Jack Kelso, aren't you? Where's your uniform, Sarge? At home in my locker, Hogaboo. War's over, soldier. I know that, Sarge. I'm fighting a different kind of war. I fight for God now. We all fight for God, Ira. In our own no, we ways. don't. Not everything else. Elsa, are you all right? Get away from her! It's all right, Cole. He doesn't want to hurt her. Ira was with us on Okinawa. What's going on? one of those crazy guys that ran you know in, probably. Guy? Don't you remember me, Lieutenant? I remember you. No. No. You ordered me to burn that cave, Lieutenant. Oh, that yeah, that guy. I can't remember. A hospital. What is he talking about? It was war. For God's sake, I can't be held responsible for everything that happened. I don't blame you, Lieutenant. You helped me to help other people. Ira lost his mind on Okinawa, Princess. Sheldon asked the doctor to help me with that. The doctor helped me to find my path. And I helped him to the better part. Elsa's going to leave now, Ira. She will be all right. You've helped her, too. Get her out of here. Vix will help. His ex is nearby. Jack, I need this guy to make the case. Have this poor bastard given you enough? Get out of here now. For God's sake, Jack, what are you going to do? Don't cry, Liz. Sergeant Kelso has come to help me, my way. I was proud to serve with you, Jack. Get out of here, Cole! So he believes in, you know, helping people to, to go to heaven, I guess? Good that heaven... Oh, okay. Shut up. Good that... We all believe in that, don't we? Oh God! <laughs> Jeez! <coughs> Jesus, pay the case! Jesus, look at all the stop, kids! Stop, stop, stop goddamn screaming! I need to think. And how do you expect to do that, you fucking maniac? They're burned to a crisp. Finish them off. Do it humanely. We are leaving this place. You do it, belts. Get your own fucking hands dirty. I'm out of morphine. Oh, 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 it's him, yeah. Put these people out of their pain. Now, that's an order. You just 
shooting. What a dick, he shot his commanding officer. Everyone out of here now. Double time! You two get Lieutenant Belt to an aid station. Weapon team will be blown in two the minutes. What Everything the... Everything that happened in here stays okay. in here, you hear me? I don't want to ever hear another word about it. There's some reason why they shot him. I, I still, still don't really get it. Okay, whatever. Killed that map! You're doing him a favor, Nelson. Cole, up here! I'll get this great hurry, hurry! The water's rising! They're oh, first. man. Hand her up! Get out of here! You're not here! I'm not arguing! You're wounded, Jack! Let me help! What are you waiting for? Jump, Cole! Jump for it! So why does that mean he's dead? Dead now? I hope not. But that'd be interesting that they kill off Cole and, and leave Jack alive. They kind of replace Cole as the. They replaced uh, Cole with Jack as the main, main character. A little bit. Does that mean Cole's dead, or does it mean he's just, you know, have to fight for, to survive or something? Is that the end, really? Don't tell me that's the end. No mini pad today. <laughs> okay, Phelps is dead, I guess. <sighs> okay, that ca that can't be the end of the game. They didn't explain how all these guys. What happens to all these guys? All these corrupt people. We're gathered here. To honor Detective Cole Phelps. Cole Phelps was the best kind of man. Here, here. A war hero who led his men with true valor. Is that the Roy guy that. And through his corrupt? personal bravery achieved one of his country's highest honors. A cop wrongly accused who never lost his faith in the oh, LAPD so he was and the system. You belittle his memory. Elsa. Out of my way, Jack. You call yourself his friend. A detective who fought to expose the I evil see. corruption of the murderous Dr. Fontaine and the rapacious property tycoon Leland Monroe. Go to her. Will you, Herschel? A reformer who well, recognized the need Jack. to remove the odd bad apple from a department yes, made up of good men. Yeah, Herschel. what about you? A man who never gave up. Yeah, Jack. Who continued to fight enemy. the good fight. I think he knew that, Jack. The fight that cost him his own life. A good husband. And Ella speaking tongues. A good father. <laughs> and may I say, a good friend. Bullshit. You're corrupt, you piece of shit. Lying bastard. Uh, you're not telling me that's the end, really? Oh, God. It's almost... That's the end. That's the worst end that exists, man. They didn't... They didn't, uh, expose any of the, the people that were involved. The corrupt police captain, the corrupt guys... The corrupt cops, they didn't expose any of them. Bullshit, man. Fuck you, Team Panda. I hate bad endings. Yeah, yeah, credits. Good. Great. We love them. Can't skip them. So, guys, that has been Alien War. Um. I am very disappointed in the ending, uh, I'm not gonna lie about it. Uh, the, the whole game, they built up this plot, and then they just, they brought it to a, a closing, they killed the guy, the psychopath. Um, they killed off some of the, some of the goons, but, you know, I've been killing goons this game. The whole game I've been killing lots and lots and lots of goons. 
happens. I don't see... I, I just don't see how... In my opinion, in this kind of, in the, the story, they had to, they, they should have killed off the, killed off or imprisoned the, all the corrupt characters, you know, Roy, and he never really knew what happened to, what happened with his, his family and stuff. They never really explained that, you know, they, they, you know, they, you saw them, him and uh, Elsa kissing a couple times, but you never really knew, like, did he really, did he really, like, did he really do Elsa and, and cheat on his wife and be a total douchebag or was he like, you know, was it kind of gray sort of thing? And, uh, you know, all those guys keep get to keep keep doing their scheme, I guess, because they could have just find, found another psychopath, they could have find, found another murderer, they could have, um, you know, they kept kept doing their scheme, and none of the none of the bad guys were been brought to justice. What the fuck is that? That's ridiculous. So, you know, I'm not saying you know all everything has to be wrapped up, but that wasn't even close to being wrapped up in my opinion. I, I like a wrap up. I, I mean, I guess, I guess I do like a wrap up. It doesn't have to be complete wrap up. You know, like everyone's everyone's accounted for. But I I wanted to at least know what happened. I don't know what happened to any of these these criminals. I don't know what happened to any of these. What happened to the trial with any of these people? Like, did did, did they get go to trial and get convicted? Did they get did they get off? We don't know what happens from the, at this point. We don't, we don't know what happened to the assistant D or the DA, the guy that's running for DA, uh, and what he's gonna do about these uh, the, the, the vice squad and what he's gonna do about the. What he's gonna do about the corrupt cops on these criminals? So I, I guess I'm speaking in circles a little bit, but fuck the ending. I'm gonna give this. It's gonna be a big bad uh, spot for the review. But I hope you guys like the playthrough. I, I like the game. Uh, it's not at all what I expected it to be, and um, I had two high hopes. I, I hope for you know. This, I know I know Rockstar didn't develop this, but I hope Rockstar goes back. Because I really love Red Dead Redemption when it comes down to it. I really liked it, and, uh... I hope they can go back to games... They can go back to a game that, that is actually as, as, as good as Red Dead Redemption. I know they're trying something new here. It didn't really work, and I don't really think it broke into the, into the genre of, uh... I'm just trying to fill up time for the credits here. I, I, I didn't think it really broke in, you know, like, for, if you look at Heavy Rain, Heavy Rain was a game that kind of broke in to the movie, the movie, uh, linear movie, multiple choice, uh, quick time event kind of game, I, I don't know what you call it, let's say, let's say movie, I don't know how, I don't know how you can say that. We can call what we can call heavy rain. It's, it's, that, 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 that's the thing about heavy rain. It's a totally different genre. I'm just using it as an example, but it's a totally different genre. I can't pinpoint it myself. I've been playing games. I've been I've been I've been in you know the gaming industry for a while. You know I'm I'm not that old, but still I, I've I've been interested in this for a while. And growing up with something surely surely gives you uh, surely surely gives you understanding of it. And I, I think the, the I think the Heavy Rain was really... It broke into a new genre of games. Uh, that, that opened up this whole new genre that I am really disappointed that no one's following up on that. Uh, I think uh, the developer of Heavy Rain, they're called Quantic Dream. Yeah, Quantic, Quantic Dream. They are developing a new game. So, or, but it's not going to be out for a while, I think. I'm definitely going to get that one. Um, and I haven't played Heavy Rain, but I, I can get a really good feel for it because I watched a playthrough by Darkside Phil. Anyway, Heavy Rain broke into this new new genre. I think L.A. Noir was trying to do that too, like an open world detective game where you have to figure out who did it. It still came across way too linear for me. Like you basically yeah, you had an area, you had to sca uh, you had to you know scavenge for clues everywhere. You had to go, you scrounge the area for, crew, uh, for clues. And then once you had all of them in your checkbook, you go interview some wit uh, witnesses in a linear discussion. The the in the linear interview, the interviews I think were were not good uh, in many ways. I have, I have many issues with this game. 
so the difference between Heavy Rain, yeah, I know there's been detective games before. There haven't really been too many games like Heavy Rain that really did it. I mean, they really fleshed that that movie tie-in, kind of, not movie tie-in, but I can't pinpoint it. Movie, movie game, or you know, you, you know what I'm talking about. If you played Heavy Rain, seen Heavy Rain, you know what I'm talking about. And but there have been detective games, and I guess there there have been. I don't know about too many, but there have been there have been good you know heavy rain type games. But you know in, in kind of the same area, the same genre a little bit. But still, that still doesn't mean that um, that still doesn't mean that you know Eleanor. I think, and let me get down to the comparison. Yeah, Heavy Rain really broke into the genre. I think it really opened up some doors for developers. I am really surprised that no one has. I mean, I, I thought it might take a couple of years. I guess it. I guess it's only been two years or something. But I guess it would. You know, in, in these two years, we'll be seeing a new. Uh, we'll get to see some new games like that from from other developers and also from Quantic Dream. Maybe like maybe at least have something that that we can see from like from them, or at least hear what their their concept is. But no. No one has used it yet, but I still think it's a real big, it's a real big break into that to that series. And L.A. Noir, I think it kind of falls flat. I mean, it's a good idea, but I think it it it, it comes short to that kind of open open door status, a game that opens opens doors to other developers. Like, cause all all you know, all evolution of a of an entertainment medium is like games or movies or music, like anything, literature even. Is you see what another author author did, a brilliant person, or you, you see what another other person or other people did, and you, you improve on it. You, you make something, but it, you make it your own, but it's based on these these games. It's based on these three games, or you base it on other ideas, and that's how things keep evolving. And that's how that's how gaming is evolving. And uh, I think it might take a while for every the the, the heavy rain genre to or whatever genre you want to call that, thriller, action movie, whatever, or, you know, movie, movie like game, I don't know, uh, but I think definitely that, that Ellie Noir, it just kind of fell flat, you know, it, it didn't break the, det for me, detective games have never really been on top, for any, like, they didn't have any say, they don't have any say in the gaming industry, Ellie Noir was going to, and a lot of it was still first third person shooter, I, or I wouldn't have uh oh we got another cut scene here. How about this for a headline? Guess which former sixth marine hero has been promoted in the LAPD? No idea. Well it could be anybody. You give up? Tell us or hand over the fucking paper. The shadow boys, our very own silver star winning son of a bitch. Phelps? He didn't die, Jack. He did just fine, and that's all we're going to say about it, right? The one and only. Look at this picture. Golden boy getting his badge, wife and kids in tow, and looking awful humble in the process. Well, he's that phony bastard. I wonder if they've been holding my job for me after all this time. What job was that? Mechanic. Ain't you seen all the war bond movies, Sarge? All the best mechanics is women. You're gonna have to work as a gigolo from here on in. <laughs> I was a bus driver in Santa Cruz. No, no pictures in the papers or medals for me, though. Can't believe I just went through Petaloo and Okinawa just to go back to being a washing machine mechanic. How is it that jerks like Phelps get it all? It doesn't have to be that way, guys. What are you talking about? It's always going to be that way. Do you have any idea what you guys are sitting on? Yeah, a ship full of army surplus. You're sitting on surplus morphine. Two tons of it. Can you imagine what that's worth on the streets? Hundreds of thousands of dollars. You're shitting me. I'm not. You're talking about stealing it? Keep your voice down. Do you want to have us all throw in the brig? God damn it, Sheldon. You want to go into the dope business? No. I want to be in the peace dividend business. What is that supposed to mean? It means I want the guys who fought for a better future to get some share of it. You interested, Jack? Come on, Top. We could all get out from under. Oh, it's the chance of our lives. It's everyone or no one, boys. I'm not having a bar of it, Courtney. You may be the bravest person I have ever met, but I swear to God, trouble follows you around like a pet fucking dog. I thought you wanted to try for medical school. So what do you want, Jack? 
What's the future got in store for you? You guys were all heroes in the war. Every single one of you. Even if your next door neighbor or your wife never know it and don't give a rat's ass. Fuck belts and medals and citations and parades. Fuck the public who are bored with returning GIs. I have nothing but respect for what you guys and the rest of the Sixth have done. You go through with this, and you'll be nothing to me. Nice speech. Okay. Is that the last cutscene here, or are we gonna see some more shit? Or is that, is that the end of the game now? Because I. It might, I always thought the credits were the end, and the credits were the end. Like, like 99% of the games, the credits are the end, and there's maybe another cutscene. Oh, maybe this is not the end! Oh, it is the end, okay. So I basically wrapped up the whole thing I was talking about in the, in the, in the credits, and I'll, I'll, I'll go into that in my review, when I do that eventually, is... Ellie uh, Noir, it is a detective game. It, I think it was trying to break it, break the detective game out of its enclosed box of no one giving a shit about it. Basically, <laughs> this is the best way I can put it. And it was trying to get into the mainstream category, uh, and where people really said, "Oh, this is a this is a, a genre we can really do something with." And half the game, or more, was third person shooter action or third person action I don't think this game I, I think the game basically failed in that regard I think Heavy Rain was trying to do something completely different it was trying to say you define what this is you make what this is um, we're trying to create, create something completely new we're trying to break a new genre in basically what what Ellie Noir was doing but with an old genre I think Heavy Rain Succeeded, even if you haven't seen the results of it yet. Ellie Noir failed, uh, for the most part. You know, many people are gonna say, "Oh, this is such a great game." I, I think it's really not. Uh, it's really not that great. But I thank you guys for watching again, and I'll see you guys another time. Thank you for watching this uh, long playthrough.